Hello, welcome or welcome back to the channel. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you're good. And welcome to another available book up. Unboxing. Yeah. I've got my unboxing friend and we've got this very fancy new packaging. And what I just realised down here. It says Bomb Book Club. Yeah. So this is very, very cool. Like that. And uh Bad. we're just gonna open it. Yeah. That's how unboxings work. Think, yeah. Let me just do this bit. Okay. Power Rangers. Yes. Go go Power Rangers. Ay ay ay. <laughs> Alright, Alpha. It's wolfing time! We're in. Okay, are you ready? Yep. Grab our first item. Starting off strong with the spook mark. Got our story on the back. Ooh, okay. What's this? Uh, Patricia Wants to Cuddle what? by it... Samantha Allen. A one of a kind queer comedy horror. Okay. Well, this might be a bit weird for the camera because they can't really. Read it. It's fine, I'll show him. So it's, I'm not sure, is that supposed to be like a rug? Whatever it is, there's lots of blood on it. Let's read the back. Renee has made it. She's in the final four, but is she dying to win? Renee should be thrilled to have been chosen as one of the final four contestants in The Catch, the world's biggest reality show. But now that she, the other contestants, and Jeremy, The Catch, have arrived on the remote wooded island for the final show, Renee is starting to wonder if there's something wrong. Is she taking a bigger risk than she thought? And as she and the other contestants begin their final challenges, they slowly realise that the island they've been taken to is hiding a terrifying secret, one that could make the final elimination event all too real. It does sound like it could be quite cool. I'm not sure how it's a queer comedy, though. Um, but maybe I'll find out when I read it. I really like the cover. It's got a really like, soft feel to it as well, hasn't it? I feel, feel how soft it feels. Do you feel it? Yeah, I feel kind of like a... weird. Feel soft. Yeah, soft. Feel soft. So yeah, that sounds really cool actually. I'm quite quite intrigued by that one. Okay, what else we got? Next thing. I think we got Kylie. Oh no. Oh. Oh, it's the worst thing that could happen. <laughs> it's Cassandra Corson. <laughs> no! Okay. Wow! Wow! Why did it say? This I do not want to read that. Oh, this is a this is a signature for um, Patricia wants to cuddle. So I'm going to put that over there. Why is the worst thing? Um, that? because I this is the same author that wrote nothing but black and teeth, and I absolutely hated that book. Hated it so much. <sighs> maybe okay. you don't need to read it, or maybe if you now I have it, I'm like my punish myself okay let me read it to you myths are full of lies this is not one of them fleeing the downfall of an empire a mermaid and her plague doctor companion escape into the eerie shadows of a wintry forest amongst the bark and snow they are drawn into ancient games for ageless children a murderous hunt of blood and sacrifice deep in the woods where three who call themselves saints rule over them all like gods Trapped in a feverish nightmare of masked monsters, stitches and surgeons, and needle teeth, the mermaid must embrace all of her cruelty and hungers to free the children. Well, what if you like him? Ah, <sighs> she's just such a terrible writer. Like, it was... Nothing but black and teeth was just so bad. I do not want this. But now I have it, I might rage read it. Okay. Let's let's finish on a high, hopefully, with our pre-loved book. <laughs> hopefully it's not worth by that same author but the one that no you... it won't be because she doesn't have any other books but i know that there's people watching this that are probably laughing themselves silly right now because my hatred for nothing but black and teeth is well known so go on here you go the rest i can't believe it what are the chances why would they put that in the first one was so bad okay it's, the, it's a james herbert it's the fog which i already have okay so we're not we're not finishing on a high. I think I already have the fog. Excuse me? Yes. Yeah, I already have this. <laughs> okay, I already have it, and I'm pretty sure I got it from a Bomber Book Club because it's a, um, a pre-loved book. So, this is not the most successful box. It's not the most successful box because the pre-loved book I already have and received it from them. I am, I'm almost angry 
die own this. Yeah, don't, don't look at it again. Don't ever look at it again. I'm so angry that I own it that I'm probably going to read it just for the rage factor. But I am quite intrigued by this one. So one out of three. This It's not the best part. Yeah, it's never this. I cannot believe that I have this now. I'm I'm literally full of so much rage. Like um, like uh, I'm trying to think of the name. Oh, Hulk! Like Hulk. Yeah, I'm I'm basically Hulk at this point. It's it's another really short one. It's like 120 pages. I'm probably I'm I might if you would like to see me rage read this in a vlog. Let me know. Maybe I'll do that. But this sounds really cool. I'm, I'm intrigued by this one. I'm intrigued by this one. So it's not our best box. Yeah, it's probably one of our worst books. But, you know, I can't blame a Born Book Club for that. They can't be expected to remember what they've sent everyone. Come on, there's like so many subscribers. And, you know, it is what it is. This sounds good. I can kind of blame them for this. Because they sent out nothing but black and teeth. And I was super excited for it. But, I mean, it is annihilated on goodreads like it is not i think it's like a two point something on goodreads which is low uh i don't let me see what this is on goodreads although if it's just come out i don't trust it because nothing but black and teeth was like four and a half stars or something until people actually started to read it okay this is currently a 3.79 with 887 ratings nothing but black and teeth now has 29,000 ratings and it's a 2.7 so I do not imagine that this is going to stay at whatever I said it was a 3.8 3.79 for long I'm really angry <laughs> okay so I would give this box a 10 out of 10 for the new packaging yeah new packaging very cool yeah, really like that it, yeah. I actually might keep that I might find some way to display that because I think that's really cool yeah I would too it's really cool isn't it uh, if this is the featured book, which I think it is because we have the signature, I would need to look at the um, online thing, but I would give this, I would say probably an 8 out of 10 for intrigue. Uh, I'm quite I, intrigued, but I'm mean, in interested in reading it. I might give it uh, about 5 out of 10. Having a little flick through, it looks like it's got some mixed uh, media stuff in it, so that's quite cool. Um, this, 0 out of 10. Minus 5. <laughs> minus 100 minus 100 i'm so out of 10. minus 100 i'm so angry and then uh, i can't really rate this it's not their fault that i already had it they can't be expected to remember but um i am interested in picking it up so it's not a bad pick for me it's just i already have it so overall maybe like a six From maybe a seven maybe a seven out for what out of ten for what for just well no i would I'd say a six i'd say a six it's getting bumped up because of the packaging but maybe like a six out of ten but never mind they can't all be winners they can't yeah. all be winners we've been doing pretty well with the boxes recently haven't we so yes one that's not a one that's not really a win can't really hold it against them they're still a great box aren't they yes okay we'll leave it there i i don't want to keep going on about how angry i am about the cassandra core book yeah. it is what it is it is what it is let me know if you want me to rage read it and do a vlog for it because I'm, I'm tempted I might do it anyway just for the lols so that's everything from us if you have any thoughts on the box let me know in the comments below or if you just want me to know you're here that pair part is always appreciated thank you guys so so much for watching if you're not already subscribed and you'd like to see more bookish content from us remember to hit that button leave a like if you want to and we'll see you in the next one bye bye, bye.